there is 75 percentage increase in amount in 5 years at simple interest. What will be the compound interest of rupees 40,000 after 2 years at the same rate? Here, for 5 years, increase is equal to 75 percentage. Then, for 1 year, increase is equal to 75 by 5, that is 15 percentage. So, rate, for, rate is equal to 15 percentage. That means 15 by 100. 5 goes 3 times in 50. 5 goes 20 times in 100. So, 20 unit is the principal and 3 unit is the interest. Then, take the ratio between principal and amount to calculate the compound interest for 40,000. Here, compound interest is calculated at the same rate. That's why principal is equal to 20 parts for 1 year. And amount is equal to principal plus interest, that is 20 plus 3, 23 unit for 1 year. Now, we need to calculate compound interest for 2 years. So, take the square of 20 unit and 23 unit. Now, here 20 square is equal to 400. And 23 square is equal to 3 square is equal to 9. 2 into 3 into 2 is 12. Remaining 1, 2 square plus 1, 5. So, here 400 is to 529 is the principal and amount for 2 years. So, I will write it as 400 parts and 529 parts. If you take the difference between principal and amount which is equal to 129 parts. 529 minus 400, 129 parts. Here, 400 parts is equal to, that is here, principal is equal to 40,000. So, he equate 400 parts with 40,000. Now, you can see. 400 parts is equal to 40,000 means 400 into 100 is 40,000. So, this is 1 part is equal to 100. If 1 part is equal to 100, 129 part is the compound interest. Compound interest is 129 parts which is equal to 129 into 1 part is equal to 100. So, 12,900 is the compound interest for 2 years. So, option C is your answer.